trichloroethylene, also known as TCE, is a non-flammable, colorless liquid with a somewhat sweet odor. It is used mainly as a solvent to remove grease from metal parts and is also used in some adhesives, paint removers, and spot removers. TCE is not thought to occur naturally in the environment. It can be released into the air, water, and soil at places where it is produced, used, or disposed of. Although TCE breaks down rather quickly in air, it breaks down slowly in soil or water and has been found in underground water sources and many surface waters. People can be exposed to TCE through inhalation, ingestion, and dermal exposure. According to the Agency for Toxic Substances and Disease Registry, exposure to moderate amounts of TCE may cause headaches, dizziness, and sleepiness. Large amounts may cause coma and even death. Eating or breathing high levels of TCE may damage some of the nerves in the face. Exposure to high levels can also result in changes in the rhythm of the heartbeat, liver damage, and evidence of kidney damage. Skin contact with concentrated solutions of TCE can cause skin rashes. The ATSDR also reports there is strong evidence that TCE can cause kidney cancer in people and some evidence for TCE-induced liver cancer and malignant lymphoma. Sources of TCE exposure for the general population include contaminated air and water, which are typically the most important sources of exposure, indoor air which may contain TCE that has migrated from contaminated soil and groundwater to the indoors through such things as cracks in a foundation in a process known as vapor intrusion. TCE can also readily enter the air from water, including contaminated bath and shower water. By living in proximity to sites where TCE is produced or waste sites containing the chemical, and by using TCE containing products such as stains and varnishes, adhesives, paint removers, and cleaners. Sources of TCE exposure for workers include those involved in the manufacture of the chemical, workers using degreasers that contain TCE, and workers in the dry cleaning industry. These are just a few things to know about TCE and exposure risks. To learn more about this or other health and safety, indoor air quality, occupational, or environmental issues, please visit the website shown on the screen. IAQ-TV, the place to be.